Hello everyone, welcome to what is now the fourth video in our series. First off, I want to say thank you to everyone who liked and commented on the last video, including Sam Barber, who said, Yup, the Alphilies, you can call me out. <laughs> John Heinemann says, You aren't having a good time with the players. Looking forward to following this series. Yup, cowboy. Yup, Sean. Thanks very much for the support. And Steffi Chu, of course, returns and says, You shall not pass Gallagher. <laughs> Just wait and see. Anyway, that's enough from me. Thanks again uh, for your support and enjoy the video. We're going to play the B team pretty much here and because uh, it's a cup game in the EFL Cup and I don't particularly care about it because it's not a priority for me this season. So we're here at Vitality Stadium for game two. Um, yet to play a home game yet, yet to visit the pot. We got a win first game against Cardiff on the road. Uh, we are playing the B team here. I'm expecting a trashing like Bournemouth have their stronger team out. We are playing on a hard difficulty. Oh my! Ah! I forget that we're uh playing with like s skillless jobbers oh that's a bad throw bro oh come on lads that's a pass back the ref says fuck rules this is the league cup honestly no one gives a shit anyway <laughs> right we want to either get a goal or concede a goal because the last thing we want is extra time and all our players to be bollocksed Honestly, this this has been a nothing game where nothing is coming off. I I don't know what I really expected, but but so far it's been toothless. Thing is, I don't really want to use subs unless I absolutely have to, because I'm gonna need fresh players for the next game. I might be promoting guys from the youth academy sooner than I would have liked as well, just in terms of needing players to fill out this team. Is that a penalty? What? <laughs> I went from like no fells ever, like ever, to just fells all over the place for handballs. Agony. Son of a bitch. Look, I can't even get mad because that probably shouldn't have been a penalty to begin with. I mean, a lot of theatrics there. <laughs> I think Ro just trying to make things look flashier than they are. Get. Ah. Get. Ah. Get. Ah. Honestly, this rest just like I I I don't give a shit about the League Cup. He's like, I just want to go home. Whoa. Too much stink on that. Billy Sharp's not great at the L set pieces, boys. <laughs> that being said, I don't think there's a set piece taker in this team. I think that's a handball. Honestly. Turning handballs on has been ludicrous. Bournemouth are, are just busy playing basketball. Like they're not touching this ball at all. Or they they're touching this ball too much. So it finishes nil nil, which means extra time, which I really didn't want. Oh, it's just straight to penalties. Okay. Well, Billy Sharp, it's your chance to redeem yourself. Ah, come on, I got there. That's bullshit. Oh, we'll take that. Didn't want to go high after the last time. <laughs> he, cracked his, he cracked his face. Did I not see that? Do you know, I've done a load of penalty drills with these guys. And uh, no one on the team is a particularly good penalty taker. So, 
they tend to go all over the place. I'm gonna try smash this top pins. <laughs> Just as well I did. All right, comes down to this Glover on row. I'm going left. Oh, I pre-dived. <laughs> now I'm just gonna go slightly to the right. Hope for the best. Ah, oh, didn't matter. He fell over running. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Away I go. Maybe I should be playing on the wing. Speed and lads are chuffed. Elated. Elated. Take that, Barnabas. Now we have to play an extra game. Bollocks. I actually forgot to unmute the uh, the game sounds, so there's no game sounds for that match. Sheffield United have come in and tried to sign Jordan Buckley. Uh, and who are they offering in exchange? Oliver Norwood. No. Tangai Nianzu off of Bayern is someone who I'm looking at uh, bringing in, just as kind of covered for the centre back areas. The only thing is, he is injury prone and he might cost a bit more than I want to pay. So I'm gonna see if I can get him for for around 3 million. You know, 3.8 with a 7% sell on clause, I'll take that out any day of the week. Like that's, yeah, okay, I'm, I'm okay with that. He's only looking for 10,500. Look, to take a pay cut to come to us, I'm I'm happy. Like, I'm, I'm always happy when we're improving the team. Oh, Manning. We can make an approach for Manning. And as I mentioned, he's an ex Potteries player. If we can get him for between three and four million, I'd be happy. Yeah, we do need a new left back as well. So I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try offer him 11.5 to begin with. With 50k sign on, hopefully. No, he's not interested. Manning, we'll be back in for you. We failed this time, but next time. Next time we got you, bud. I think it's time to transfer list another player in Leo Clayton. I'm just, I'm weighing up his age against, you know, his usefulness to the squad, and I just don't see where he's gonna fit in. Um, the other thing is I'm kind of looking at maybe bringing in another striker to the team. Like I already have four here, but I'm kind of trying to retrain Koulibaly as a winger. So if I can retrain him as a winger, I don't see much use in the team for Clayton anymore at the moment so unfortunately it means that he's being sold on. Mason Steele I don't even know where the hell he came from but I'm gonna send him out on loan if I get an offer. Cameron Smart honestly not that that good of a player. Another player who's gone on the loan list. Making one change to the starting 11 and that is Nianzu is now on the subs bench. It's on to the first home game of the season ladies and gentlemen welcome to the pot. We've got the Potteries, who have started off in strong form. You know, we've had two wins. I mean, you can count it as a win and a draw. Looking for a third here against Coventry. Uh, club tracksuits, of course, available from uh, thepotterystore.com. The Pot Shop. That's definitely a website. Don't go there. <laughs> Don't go <laughs> Oh, we're kicking off here. Keller has saved my bacon. Keller has been a... A shoot signing so far. Holy crap. That was shambolic. Kalahar once again saving the day. Calero not being spectacular in that right back position so far for us. Best has been very good for me in the centre back position. He knows. Oh, Kalahar. Ah, chef's kiss. How many saves is that? He has proved invaluable so far. Kelleher. Oh, punches it. This is sloppy. Sloppy. <sighs> Kelleher just wanted to get another save on the on the score sheet. Like, oh, lads. Kelleher. <laughs> Honestly, game of his life right now. Oh, go. Go, Alfie. Go. Oh. Too much of a touch from Alfie Lees. Honestly. It's risky subbing off the defense when, I was gonna say when they've been playing so well, but I don't know if they have been, it's just, Keller has been unplayable. Oh my God, I shouldn't have taken that second time. What was that? 
Okay. Plants on the wing. Making ground here. That wasn't who I wanted the ball to get to. That's not good. Oh, I can't tackle for shit. No, 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 no. I was like, I cannot concede. Like, I can't concede this late on. After, like, Kelleher's performance, it would be heartbreaking. Why did he sound so depressed about Martin Waghorn coming on there? Oh, come on! That's That's gotta be it full time, folks. There's some positives to take. Kelleher played tremendously well. Not many others did, but Keller played very well. Best was, was quite good at centre-back. Um, look, it could always be worse. Nil-nil the first game in the pot. Not great, could be worse. Man of the match, who was it? Never in question, 9.6. 9.6 for Queeveen. Like, oh. Never mind, their goalkeeper got a 10. I just want to know why I'm getting offers for all the wrong players here. Like, Ferguson, we wanted to get rid of. Okay, that's fair. Plants, we took too long to decide whether we were going to sign a replacement for him or not. We tried to, it didn't come true, and the loan to buy has fallen true as a result. Hansen, I'm not really looking at selling, and I don't really have a replacement for him at the moment. He's not great, but... And then Austin Hilton, 66 overall. 25 maybe maybe we'll have a look is there anyone in the shortlist who can play as a fullback manning can't sign him yet the last negotiations broke down so da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. <laughs>